opening minute of the second quarter. Titans up by one. Quick throw to the outside. Nothing happening right there, though. Catch is made there by Burks. And Douglas is right there to stop him. No game. Again, you, you see it. We see it every single week when you watch football, college, and pro. Quarterbacks saw it earlier with Aaron Rodgers. Some people call that a, a run pass option. I, I think it's more of an alert when you feel that your guy can win one on one. And he looked out there and saw Burks against Douglas and thought he'd make him miss five to seven positive yards. But Douglas makes the play out in space, makes a nice, does a nice job on in coverage there. They throw again and they throw with effectiveness into a lot of traffic catch made there by the man who picked up uh, that's Burks Traylon Burks the man who earlier tonight big gain to get him rolling he's carried the, or he's caught three now for 48 yards of course he had the turf toe earlier went on the IR missed four games came back last week and you know he has size and speed to give you yards after the catch. From behind, Tannehill is hit, but he's able to stay in the pocket, get the pass away. Burks making the grab. Quay Walker, two minutes to the half. Burks takes the handoff. Quay Walker yep. makes the tackle there. Comes back into the backfield. On a third and three, Tannehill throws, caught, and that's going to set up a first and goal as Burks takes it to the fourth. He's strong with confidence we've not seen for a while. 21 to 25 for 282. Off play action, fires, intercepted at the 14. Rasul Douglas. And tackled up at the 34-yard line by Tannehill. So right after we're talking about Tannehill and the big night he's having, throws the pick. Exactly what Green Bay needed to try to get back into it, down by 10. Second one, you're expecting a run. Watch the corner drop immediately. And the thing is, Ryan Tannehill never looked that way. Tannehill looks left. He's sizing up the receiver. Does not see that corner. Doesn't expect on second one that Douglas would drop back into coverage. So good recognition there by Douglas. Good job by Joe Barry making sure of the awareness there. The only receiver that went out on that second one. And Douglas makes the play. Tannehill healthy and in a good place. It's going to be tough. Well, play action. Last play before the two-minute warning. And you might as well go deep. And you might as well go to your... Rookie receiver Burks, and that sets up a first and goal at the five yard line. 51 yards. And that takes us to the two minute warning. Again, it's it kind of symbolic of what they've done tonight. The way they've moved the ball is not Derrick Henry running, but it's been some gadgets and some wrinkles. This time, of all people, you're going to go after Jair Alexander, who's probably sleeping on the play. He's right. not expecting that, right? The rookie's going to go by him. What a throw and what a catch. You're thinking for all the world, oh, they're going to run it. Two-minute warning, run a couple of more right. plays, maybe punt right. with a few seconds left. Instead, you know, when you think about it, that's really a brilliant play. Well, you have a great holiday. And you too. I'll, I'll see you soon. Yeah. Well, we, we saw the turkeys. We didn't see the ducks or the chickens. But if my man Madden was still around, they'd be in trouble too. <laughs> What a win for Braves yeah. on the road here in Lambeau.